Hi everybody, it has officially been three weeks since my surgery. It's actually been 25 days because today is the 25th of January and I just wanted to come on real quick, give you guys an update and thank each and every one of you who prayed, who commented that they were praying for me, who sent me messages. You guys, God is answering your prayers and my prayers, my family's prayers, so thank you so much. So, I am officially able to swallow food, which is such a blessing and maybe a curse at the same time. Um, I did lose 12 pounds. I have not weighed myself since I have been eating food because, I mean, do we really need to do that? <laughs> so, okay, here are some complications that I'm having. Y'all, I have had a burrito once and... I knew like not to eat at all, but I didn't know that I was full. And so after I finished eating it, um, and y'all, I didn't really eat too much of the burrito like skin, like the bread part of it. Oh my Lantis, I was in pain for three hours, maybe longer. I had to take a pain pill and I went to bed um, because my whole entire stomach area was swollen and I was just in so much pain. Apparently I didn't learn my lesson and I decided to go, I think like what, Monday? So three or four days ago to Mexican again. And I had two tacos, just the soft tacos. And this is my first time eating chicken. It was shredded chicken. Y'all, I was in worse pain this time. So um, swallowing. So here's how this works. I can swallow food, but it takes a while for it to go down. Um, so let's just say like, I started trying like toast because they said that's a good idea to do toast and I would put avocado on it and I wasn't having really big issues with it going down. So I would have three pieces of toast, sometimes two pieces of toast with the avocado. And then when I would go to drink water, I would take a sip of it it would feel like I was choking. Like it felt like a knot like in my throat. And y'all, I was so scared, like super scared. And then I went to the mall with Brianna and I had an Annie Ann's pretzel because I just love Annie Ann's pretzels and you can't go to the mall and not have an Annie Ann's pretzel. And so immediately after like four bites, I thought I was choking so bad that I, my pro, my thought process was, oh my gosh, they're going to have to do like a Heimlet thing or whatever where they like press on you and like try to get the stuff to come out. And I was like, they're going to break my, my, my chest where I already have wires on it. And just, it was scary. I know it was scary for Brianna. So anyways, um, I saw the doctor on Tuesday and he said that it sounds like my esophagus is having some muscular issues. So when food goes down, it does this little number and tries to work its food, the food all the way down to your stomach. And it just sounds like that it's being slow to catch up with everything that's happened, he said. So he wants to see me again in two weeks. I can officially go back to work next week. So I'm super excited about that. And uh, I think that's all the updates. So... I think like the pain that I'm having, he says, like uh, those two times that I ate those Mexican burritos or whatever, or tacos, um, he says it's called gas bloat syndrome or something. So I don't know, but the plan is to not have Mexican. I'm going to like continue to just let this work its way out and I'm going to continue to let the recovery happen, which I am doing a good job at, I think. And I mean, it could take up to like three months to six months like from the stuff that I've read. So um, that's all. So thanks again for all your support. And do you want to see my incisions? They're still the same. Let's see. Bring the camera down. This is an ugly shirt, but I'm just chilling around the house. So, and it does, I don't match, but don't judge me. So there we go. Incisions. If you look close, they still got the glue and stuff on them too. So That is all. All right, you guys, have a great west, a great rest of your day, morning or night, whichever time you're watching this. And guess what? I turn another year older. Tomorrow is my birthday. Oh yeah, I turned another year older. So, see y'all.